Hi everybody and welcome to a very quick episode of Gaffer and Gear. I was about to pack up and I thought, nah, I'll just do one very quick little tip video. So in this video, I'm gonna show you a little trick I have for finding where the center of gravity is on a tube light. So before we get into that, why would you even want to find the center of gravity? Well, imagine you're rigging a light overhead and you, um, your rigging isn't in line with the center of gravity. What can happen over time is uh, your setup can sag to one side, okay? so. Best practice is always to mount to the center of gravity, but not all tubes have the center of gravity in the center of the tube. For example, you might have a tube light that has a battery attaching to one side, for example, or you might have your own external battery mounted to one side, you know, whatever. So um, all of my tubes, the center of gravity is in the center, so they're not the best things to demonstrate on. So what I'm gonna use is a C-stand arm because that's uh, definitely out of balance. Now this is a little trick I learned in, I think it was year nine science uh, in high school. So it's something to do with friction and gravity. I wasn't really paying attention. I was too interested in the, in the girl two rows over. But it's a little trick I, I did remember and I did learn. So uh, here's what happens. Basically the finger that's closest to the center of gravity, that's got more weight on it and that's gonna stick to the rod. So if I move that around, the rod's gonna move. And the finger that's not the closest to center of gravity, that's gonna move freely. So what I do is I move my fingers in closer together and I find the center of gravity. It's a cool little trick. There is center of gravity, how cool is that? Okay, very good little trick. Can't remember the science behind it, but at least I learned something in high school, so that's pretty nifty. Now, if you're doing that with a, um, a tube light, of course, don't do it with your fingers because you might drop it. So uh, what I do is I put my hands around it like that and then bring my hands together. And there's center of gravity in the center of the tube. All right, take care of each other, guys. See you on the next episode. <laughs>